Welcome to the first episode of Random with a Chance of Vampires. We have the Forks weather report. On Monday, Tuesday, and Wednesday, it's going to be sunny, so you vampires better stay inside. And it's going to be hot, so humans leave your coats at home. And Thursday and Friday, Thursday vampires can go to school, yay! And Friday, maybe vampires should stay home, because clouds are going to be iffy. Alright, that was the Forks Weather Report. And now moving on to the Tweet Report. Last Monday, David Slade tweeted that he is doing some editing on Eclipse. Billy Burke, Charlie, hints that he saw New Moon. Thursday, David Slade says that Taylor had to hold Kristen for a couple hours. Gil Birmingham says that he's excited about telling the Quileute kids about the Quileute legend. Peter Facinelli says he's playing in the woods while shooting a clip on Sunday. Finally, David Slade says he's doing night shoots with the wolves. And that wraps up the Tweet Report. Taylor Lautner had a very sexy photo shoot. And here's one of the pictures. And there's a link on the sidebar. Last Sunday, it was Bella's birthday. And if you're keeping count, she's 22. His Golden Eyes did a video of pictures of the set of Eclipse. Here's the link. It's on the sidebar. All three trailers mixed together in story order. At the VMAs also, Kristen, Rob, and Taylor do a very new moon pose for the cameras. Here's a picture. Bella's truck showed up on the HBO show True Blood. Here's the proof. At the new moon premiere in Knoxville, Tennessee, Kristen and Taylor will be attending. Taylor finally has his own calendar, and it was well worth the wait. Here's a picture, and you can get it on Amazon. There's a new Team Jacob version of New Moon out there. Here's a picture. The new one's soundtrack now includes For You I Would by The Used. The Wolves are back in Vancouver for Eclipse filming. Taylor and Ashley both agree that Eclipse will be more guy-friendly and have more action. Bath and Body Works has a Twilight-themed product, a couple of them. Here's the picture, and there's a link on the side where you can find them. Brie talked about Eclipse and how being a part of Twilight has changed her life. There's a link on the sidebar. There are now Edward Cullen wigs and pea coats on sale for Halloween. So all you Twy guys out there that want to be Edward Cullen for Halloween, there you go. Here's a picture of the packaging. New Moon is now officially rated PG-13. At Hot Topic, there are Alice Cullen outfits, so all you cute Alice girls out there, that's where you want to find them. There's a link on the side. New Moon tickets went on sale this week, and in some places, they're already selling out. So get your ticket while you can. Chris Weitz did an interview, and there's a link on the side if you want to read it. On the sidebar, sidebar, we have a very funny Edward Cullen song. Really, you should check it out. It's funny. The Killers and Grizzly Bears are now supposed to be, are going to be, on the New Moon soundtrack. Here is a picture of Taylor and Kristen's outtakes from the e-photo shoot. There are more at the link on the sidebar. There is another new moon calendar, surprise, surprise, and here's a picture. E did an interview with Royce King where he said he wasn't originally in the script, which made me angry, but then I realized he's in the script now, so what does it matter? And that wraps up the news.
Now it's time for the new moon countdown. <laughs> 60, 60 days. days. Uh, We're so excited. We're so excited. Yay. <sighs> if you have any suggestions for Random with a Chance of Vampires, please leave a comment below and we'll see what we can do. Hope you enjoyed our first show. See you next week. Bye. Peace. Peace. Love. Love. Twilight.